ready? Yes. What's up guys, I'm Dr. Donald, this is Dr. Ben, and today we're gonna go over a daily feel good for pain in front of the shoulder, whether that be biceps tendonitis, shoulder impingement, what are some other scary diagnostic terms? Uh, biceps tendonitis, shoulder impingement. <laughs> Perfect, so this will be great for you guys, okay? Even if you have like tight shoulders in the front or if you're working all day like this, this will be great for you. Um, so I'm gonna demo and this young gentleman here is gonna teach you guys what you guys are doing. Yeah, so the goal of this is we got some pain in the front of the shoulder or chest area right now here. Now I have some pain there. So we're gonna to try to fire up the backside right here, get everything working, and we're gonna do it in that Tabata format. So let's go ahead and get started. So the motion that we're gonna to do today is a prone, which means face down, W. Reason it's a W is your arms will make a W. Perfect. We're gonna do the Tabata format, which means we're gonna do it for 20 seconds on of a hold, 10 seconds rest. And we're gonna go through this a total of four times, which will last approximately, actually exactly, <laughs> two minutes. So, perfect. let's go ahead and get started. So he's gonna come up. Key thing right here, you want to imagine that you're trying to pull your shoulder blades into your back pockets. Boom, so we're getting that. We have a nice long neck. So I want you to imagine that you got a string on the top of your head pulling you straight into the wall that way. He's got a little bit of a chin tuck like this, making a double chin and he's pulling back. If you are feeling a lot of tension or discomfort in this low back area, then you're probably arching up way too high. Yeah, we're not trying to get the low back completely fired up. What we're trying to do is engage the muscles in between the mid back and between the shoulder blades. Fire these guys up, create a lot of neural drive here. You can come down, that's been roughly a time I haven't been paying attention to, we'll say 20 seconds. You'll rest for 10 seconds and you're gonna come back up. Perfect. Couple things here too is if you're doing this and you're cramping, like you start to feel cramps in some of these areas, just back it off a little bit. You wanna be able to engage right here, but you don't need to get so much tension or tone that every part of your body feels like it's gonna explode. Come on down. That is the prone Y for shoulder pain to make you feel better. Perfect. Yeah, so again, guys, this is good for not just shoulder pain, but you can use it for tightness in the front, or if you're stuck in this position working a lot and you find yourself in this position, maybe you're stressed out a lot and you feel like here. Um, so don't feed that when you're doing the motion. Like Dr. Ben said, shoulder blades, back pocket, mm -hmm. right? That's yeah. important. And lastly, before you go, you can do this just in a seated position at your desk as a modification. That's true. Yeah. So that would come here, arms would be up, mm -hmm. locking down. Same concept. Yep, as I'm locking down here, my goal is to draw my elbows down to the floor. So if I was standing up and I wanted to create tension, it would be like I'm trying to touch the ground with my elbows and then make my head very long. Yep. And be like this from that angle. Mm -hmm. And then lastly, if you guys are doing this and you start to feel any pain, numbness, or tingling in your hands or fingers, I want you to stop it, yeah. reach out to us yep. or a professional in your area and let's see what's going on with those nerves. Yeah, that's a, a, a good segue to, um, if you guys want to reach out to us, mm -hmm. what is our email? Info at kirehab.com. Beautiful. And if this is on Instagram, you can hit us up through our DMs and please feel free to reach out to us guys. We love to help. This is why we're doing this, yep. is to help you guys. Yep. So start the conversation and we can probably guide you in the best direction to yep. go. Until next time. Happy New Year, Merry Hanukkah, Merry Christmas. We're filming, Merry we're filming this during this time. It, it may reach them a little later, but the spirit is with you. Yeah. And then happy Thanksgiving. Yes. Until next time, guys. <laughs>